Hold on. This thing right in front of Harry on the ground. Is that a trash can? Is that a triangular trash can? How strange. My first thought was they're trying to save on the polygon budget. But they could have just went with a rectangular or, or square trash can and that would have been, well, I guess it would have been slightly more polygons, but just almost the same. Ooh. Yes. I'm feeling... Ooh. I didn't know I could even get anything from in there. I'm feeling pretty confident about my health right now. I've got a lot of health drinks. And at least one med kit. And how many rounds do I have? Oh, that's weird. This time my gun didn't reload itself. Uh, yeah, 15 plus 8 rounds. Not bad, not great either. I'm actually surprisingly hurt. So let's take a health drink. There we go. I don't even remember where I got hurt from. Let's save again. See if this can take me out to the hallway. Oops. Okay, so there's a lot to this school, but we're blocked from exploring most of it right off the bat. Yeah, I, I can't get to the rest. Ah, oh, fuck me. I can't get to the rest of the school through the hallways, but I probably can do it through the courtyard because it exit out, exits out the other side of the school. Fuck me. Okay. All right. Here we go. Yes, these things. Um, I don't... Uh, I'm going to see if I can melee them to death. Maybe this is the final, finally the first type of enemy that can be easily meleeed. If the flying birds and dogs are definitely not. Whoa. Damn, they'd really dig into me. Okay. Uh, definitely took a bit of damage there. Not too much, though. I don't think I need to heal. But yeah, they don't just, like, swipe at you with a knife. They, like... I guess they just, like, outright stab you, because they kind of get, like, stuck to you for a second or two. How, what? What are they, though? God, this music's disturbing. I wish I could zoom in. Um, I mean, they're humanoid, they have knives, they make odd noises. Humanoid, but definitely they don't really look human. Is that a tail? Do they have a tail? They got like... Are those maybe breasts? And their face is awfully green for some reason, but I can't tell why. I don't know what they are. Oh, this is the clock tower. A silver moon. A golden sun. It's locked. The hands are stopped at 10 o'clock. Okay, that was one of the times on one of the things. I think the one for the alchemy lab? 
So yeah, that's probably the one I have to do first before I can do any others. And then I guess I can probably go inside once I find these two things, which are basically keys of some sort. Oh god. Oh, you little shit. Uh, no. Ah, oh, fuck. Alright, well the other one's kind of ignoring me for a second, so I'll just try to get this one. Ah. Oh! What? Wow, I'm, I'm really bad at judging where my health is. Uh, getting out of the weapon mode, hitting the action button. Harry will kick or step on that enemy to kill it if it's lying on the floor. Yep, yeah, I already know that, that tip. Yeah, I'm super bad at judging when I'm actually about to die. Because I felt like I took a ton of damage to begin with. I checked my health and it was still almost green, so I didn't bother healing. And then I felt like I took much less damage in that encounter, and yet it killed me. Weird. I wish there's a way, some some indication of what your health was without checking your inventory. You know, like a... I don't, there's the panting thing, but that doesn't really help when you're in the middle of combat. Yeah, I just did combat with these two ones in the courtyard again, and I, I can't... Maybe I'm just really bad at the melee combat, and the controls are certainly really hard to, to use, but... I can't find any way to kill them without taking some serious damage. So, I'm gonna try the gun. Let's see how many shots it takes to take them out. Okay. Oh, fuck! Not bad, it was like three or four. Oh, you're still alive. It doesn't take many shots to down them, but it does take quite a few to kill them. So, 15 shots left. Wait, am I red again? Oh my god, I just used a medkit out there from the courtyard fight. Wow. Okay, so, given my previous experience, if it's not fully green, I think I'm nowhere near healed all the way. So I'll just use two, yeah. Damn. Little fuckers. They're kind of like, they seem green and mossy and almost sort of like they... What are those creatures from The Witcher? The, the Drowners from The Witcher series. They seem kind of vaguely like that. Seem a bit amphibian, a bit wet, a bit swampy. The lock is jammed, the door can't be opened. Okay. So this is feeling more like the Silent Hill 2 type thing, indicating that there's no way to open it ever, unlike the other ones where they say it's locked, indicating you can open it eventually. Maybe it just doesn't do that when you're trying to use the doors outside in the town. And it does it indoors for whatever reason. So that can potentially lead outside the back of the school. Hmm. Oh god. What? What? I see one thing, barely moving next to the door. What is it? I just see a shadow. What the fuck? Oh! What is it? What's that thing? It was small, it was like... Partially transparent, ghost-like. 
made a squeaking noise. It fell over when it tried to run, which is kind of cute and made me feel bad for it. And then it faded away. But it was indicated as a monster by the radio. Huh. I hope that doesn't have some horrible consequence. Like the fact that I didn't kill it or something. It's jammed. Yeah, I can't leave through the back. Let me leave and go back in and see if it returns. No. It's a one-time thing. I'm really curious about that. Do you think it's like those uh, glimmering lizard things in the Dark Souls series? Kill it for some titanite? Except unlike those, it doesn't come back? Or maybe just move somewhere else in the school. Okay, let's check storage. Can't be opened. I love the just aesthetic of the school. Just what the school looks like combined with uh, the chunky dithered graphics. And the spooky lighting. So damn atmospheric. A friend in need. Hold on, can I read this? Nope. Hmm. You gotta get to them real fast and kick them, otherwise they get up really quickly. And if they start their getting up animation, you can't kick them anymore. Lighting really is so impressive. Look at this. Is there nothing in here? Can't go to the bathroom. Can't use the stalls. This thing in the corner, I can't use it. Can't move the camera. Yeah, it's just a bad, bad bathroom. It's somehow spookier to me that this is just a normal bathroom. Let me just check something real fast. Yeah, well, there's a slight difference between them. One's got urinals and the other has uh, extra sink instead of a instead of urinals, but that's the only difference really. It's unlocked. Oh, that's back here. I just had to unlock it from this side. Okay. Well, let's go all the way around then. Because we know none of these doors on the left open. So the stairs are 
if I keep going down the hall, but instead let's go to the other side where there's the classrooms and stuff. Oh. Shit. So I don't know any way to get there then. There are stairs on the other side as well, so maybe I have to go up the stairs on the left side. And then, whoops. And then down the stairs to get to the other side. It's very possible. Let's head up the stairs then. Or down? Nothing inside. Oh yeah, that's just a little like supply closet or something. That's not actually stairs down. There's only stairs down in the bottom right of the school. How much ammo do I have again? Oh, I got a bit. 15 loaded, 11 in reserve. Yeah, that's not bad. Let's steal the enemies before I go into any doors. Let me see if I can do an 180. Yeah! I've never done that before. If you, uh, so the shoulder buttons allow you to strafe. If you press the right shoulder button, strafe right, uh, or right shoulder button, strafe right, left shoulder button, strafe left. If you press both of them at the same time, you do a 180. I'm probably, like, never gonna do that. I just wanted to do it once. Hmm. Ah. Now the other one's gonna get up. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, let me kick you. No. Okay, down to 15 shots. It's funny how powerful kicking is in this game. It's like, shoot an enemy three times in the chest, it'll hurt a bit. Kick them once, they're dead. So many drawings and stuff from all the the kids here. Just another classroom. Do you think the people that I'm encountering or not well, maybe people, but do you think the Entities that I'm encountering, do you think those are the kids or something? They seem kind of... I don't know. They're not very large. They are smaller than most adults, but I feel like they're also bigger than most kids. I mean, it's Silent Hill, it's not like they need to be the exact same size as the kids were if they're the kids. I feel like they might be the kids, just something just about being in the context of a school. Plus the fact that they're a little bit small makes me think kids.
Nothing in here. Okay. Let's check out the bathrooms up here. What? I hate it. Fuck. Oh, I hate it so much. That was the sound of a sound of a kid crying. I think there's a tiny bit of blood on the faucet. See those couple of red pixels there? Oh god. Fuck, 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 fuck. Mm. Nothing? Anything gonna happen when I try to leave this place? Okay. <sighs> I'm never going in there again. Got 24 shots. Alright, that's this hallway pretty much done. So, uh, yeah, I believe the chemistry lab is where I want to head to do the first... Uh, solve the first riddle, I guess. Oh, hey, there is a music room. I was thinking if there's no music room, then that riddle talking about... Uh, sound must be talking about the clock, but there is, and it's right over there. But that's not the one I need to do right now, so... Watch, I'll probably get to the other side and find the doors locked. And I gotta go the other way anyway. Okay, good. That's a new sound. Is that in the game? Yes, I thought that might have been a rumbling truck outside, but that is the game. Extra level of menace to the school. I think that's actually the first time there's been music inside of the school building, I think. There was music in the courtyard, but that's not really in the building. Oh god, what? What? Is there something in here? There isn't. The hell's that noise? Why is there another triangular trash can in the corner? There is a chemical. You don't want to elaborate? What kind of chemical? Kind of hard to do science with just random chemicals. Distilled water, no reason to take it. Okay, so this is just a supply closet, right? The lab equipment room, yes. Let's take my glucose, no reason to take it. Let's take my unidentified chemical to the lab room. Surely I'm going to need to find more than just one.
Is that a hunk of meat? Is that a hand? Statue of an old man's hand. That was mentioned in the riddle. The fist shut tight, as if never to let go. Right, so if I solve the riddle, then I think it'll let go and give me the thing in the center, which is probably one of the two keys I need for the clock tower. So is there anything I can actually do in this room? Like, do I just interact with the hand and nothing else? Alright, let's see what the riddle is. I do have to look at my picture, right? There's no... There's no, like, past documents that I've looked at kind of thing, is there? I don't think so. It's not in my inventory or anything. I guess you're just supposed to remember that sort of stuff? Or write it down? Because, I mean, when this game came out, people didn't have smartphones, so taking a picture of it wouldn't be a common thing unless people use, like, Polaroids or something. It's not really a riddle. So it says, gold in an old man's palm, the future hidden in his fist, exchange for sage's water. It's not really a riddle. The first two lines are just talking about there's something in their fist that you want to get. And then the last one, exchange for sage's water, is the only one that's a little bit nebulous, but... I, is that my chemical? Is that Sage's water? Bibble reads, concentrated hi- oh, fuck! Concentrated hydrochloric acid. Um... Does that count as Sage's water? Please tell me use isn't gonna be Harry drinking the hydrochloric acid. Okay, thank god. Gold medallion, take it. Yes. The hand almost looks bloody, but it's impossible to tell, really. Just the melted remains of a, of a, a statue of a hand. Nothing to worry about. Yeah, I really thought that'd be a riddle, but it honestly wasn't. It was basically just directions. Oh, fuck. Mm. They weren't there before, right? I wonder if the time... I wonder if it, once I complete one of the quote-unquote riddles, get one of the keys... I wonder if the clock automatically changes its time and then I can move on to doing whatever the next riddle is. Maybe that's why they've suddenly appeared? Time has changed, perhaps? It's been forever since I've saved, huh? Speaking of, I should heal myself. Absolutely, I'm orange. 13 shots. That's not much. What? What's here? Oh, it's behind the bookcase. Where am I? A library. I would like to save ammo if I can. But I'm also wondering if there's anything back there. Uh, library reserve. Here too? I saw it. Right there. Fuck, they're everywhere. Maybe if it's just one, I can whack it real good? If I'm not getting ganged up by multiple? Uh, I'm gonna... Try. Uh, 
I wish I could see it. Okay, so one on one. I can use the pipe. Major, no need to read any of these books. I wish I could read that. It's too pixely. I can probably unlock the door from this side. Oh, look! There's a square trash can. Why do they get square trash cans here instead of triangle cans? This must be the luxury lounge. 